Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to Teacher Pauline's class. Now, a few days ago, I've asked you to submit a video of yourself with your poster to encourage the doctors, nurses, and workers who are out there fighting the coronavirus. And I just want to say, all of you did wonderful. I really enjoy every one of your videos. Give yourself a big round of applause. And also, if you have yet to submit your videos, please do. I really look forward to watch them. For today's English class, we are going to fly to Lapland. Are you ready, everyone? Let's all get up on our feet. Show me your Lapland finger and sing and dance together. Ready? Sing with me. in Latland. Now, it's been a while since we went to Latland. Let's see whether you remember these characters. Do you remember who is this? You're right, it's Bouncy Ben. And what does Bouncy Ben say? B. B. Very good. Let's see whether you remember who is this. You're right, it's Munching Mike. What does Munching Mike say? Mm. Well done! Next! Do you remember who is... Who is this? You're right! It's Peter Puppy! What does Peter Puppy say? Well done! Today we are going to meet a new Letterland character. Can you guess who we are going to meet today? I'll give you some clues. This Letterland character is Circle. He's Circle. And this character lives at the docks near the ocean. And Mr. O takes care of this character. Have you got your answer? Well, let's see. Do you guess? Who do you see? Yes, you're right. It's Oscar Orange. Everyone say hi, Oscar Orange. Do you know what letter is Oscar Orange hiding in? Yes, you're right. It's the letter O. And Oscar Orange makes the O sound. Can you make the O sound? Make your lips into a letter O and go Oh! Oh! Fantastic! Are you ready to listen to Oscar Orange's story? Well, make sure you open your ears big and wide! Oscar Orange lives at the Letland docks. Every day, ships come to the docks, bringing crates and boxes. All sorts of things are unloaded at Letland docks. Olives, otters, and ostriches. Do you see the box of olives? How about the animal otter? It's right here. How about the ostrich? Can you point to me where the ostrich is? Yes, it's right here. Oscar Orange has his hands full. Perhaps the octopus will help him. How many arms does he have? Can you count how many arms does an octopus have? Let's count together. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. <gasps> 8 arms! Do you have 8 arms? You do? 
then maybe you're an octopus. Let's continue. Oscar Orange has a good old friend called Mr. O, who looks after him. He is the old man from over the ocean. He's right here. Or you can see him right here. Can everyone say hi, Mr. O? No one knows how old Mr. O is, but the older he gets, the wiser he becomes. Now, he is the oldest and wisest man in Letterland. Now, I have a challenge for you. Can you make the letter O with your hands? And how about with your arms? Can you make an even bigger letter O? Perhaps you can look for someone to help you. Are you ready to listen to Oscar Orange song? Come on, sing with me. Now it's time for a handwriting song. Show me your one little finger, put it up in the air, and follow my finger, and let's trace around Oscar Orange. Ready? Now let's try it again. Put up your one little finger and let us write letter O. You start from the top, go around, up and stop. Alright, we're going to try it again. We're going to do a small letter O. Ready? Start from the top, go around, and then stop. So this is the capital letter O and this is the lowercase letter O. Now it's time that we discover what are some things that begins with the letter O. Can you tell me what this is? Did you say octopus? Because you're right. Let's spell octopus together. Say the sounds with me. Let's go. O K O K T O P S Octopus Next, let's see whether you know what is oh, what is that? Do you say orange? Because you're right. Oh, oh, orange. Let's spell orange together. Say the sound with me. Say oh, er, and. Orange. Fantastic. Next word. What is What's that? A duck? No. Dun, 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 dun. <gasps> Do you know what this is? It is a bird with long neck and long legs. That's right. Ostrich. Let's say it together. O ostrich. Spell it with me. Say the sounds. Go. O. S. T. R. I. Ch. Ostrich. Very good. Now let's look at the last picture. What do you think? What's that? <gasps> what do you think this is? A lizard? No, this is an otter. Say it with me. O otter. In case you're curious, this is how a real otter looks like. Take a look. Ding, 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 ding. Adorable, isn't it? Let's spell otter together. Ready? 
Let's say the sound. Say oh. Er, ot. Let's say all the words together. Ready? One, two, three. Say octopus. Octopus. Next, orange. Orange. Next, ostrich. Ostrich. Last, otter. Otter. Now it's time that you bring out your. A to Z, copy master book, and look for Oscar Orange. Once you found Oscar Orange, remember to write today's day and date. Today is Monday. Let's spell Monday together. One, two, three. M O N D A Y. Monday, and it's the thirtieth of March, which is the third month, two thousand and twenty. And start labeling the pictures. Once you're done labeling, remember to do your rainbow tracing. Trace around Oscar Orange with seven different colors. Once you've completed your workbook, I have one more challenge for you. Go around your house and look for as many things as you can find that begins with the letter O. Then take a picture with the items that you have found and send it to this online classroom. And don't forget to also take a picture of your completed work so that I can have a look. Okay, children, that's all for today. Make sure you continue to stay safe and healthy, and remember to listen to your daddy and mummy. Till next time.